to college now. It's been like something out of Cedar Point for Todd Kowalczyk's crew this season. Leading the nation in overtime games, including two of their last three, and being everywhere from first to fourth in the West over the last couple of weeks. Heading into tomorrow night, they are one back with two to play. It's about as good as it gets. A division title on the line in the final week of the regular season. The Rockets, just a game back of Ball State and Western Michigan heading into their final two games, have a chance to move up on the Cardinals with a win on Tuesday night. It's a championship type game. Uh, we're right in the hunt and we gotta finish the season strong. But the final regular season home game is more than a chance to just move up in the standings. It's also senior night. The Marquette transfer, Steve Taylor Jr. in only one season at Savage, leads the MAC and is third in the nation in rebounding and in double doubles this year. John John Williams leads the team in scoring and has been an offensive threat since he was named to the MAC's all freshman team his first year. And then there's the Northwest Ohio duo. Vandal alum Zach Garber sorely missed as he is injured and out for the rest of the season. And finally, Jordan Loft, who we followed since his high school days at Napoleon. The term hustle guy has been most associated with him doing all the little things that don't show up in the stat sheet for virtually his entire career. That is until his most recent outing against Central Michigan. You know, he said it best recently, he didn't want to be just a hustle play guy anymore. But that's what he was over time. And now he's the hustle play guy, but he's also the glue guy and the best defender and the best defender in the league in my opinion right now. It's been an unforgettable ride for the Northwest Ohio native as he begins to reflect on his career in the midnight blue and gold. It's It's been a great four years, uh, but it's not over yet. Um, so we, we got a lot to play for. Um, tomorrow night's just another uh, big game for us and we got to approach, approach it that way.